for classic matches just like the World Cup videos, why not go to patreon.com forward slash drunk redhead. Hello and welcome once again to another edition of the Drunk Redhead Wrestling Classic Final Tournament. Last time out in the big match in round one, Shawn Michaels the Heartbreak Kid defeated Cactus Jack aka Mick Foley to progress to the second round and today we'll be finding out who they'll be taking on in the second round as Epico Cologne representing Puerto Rico takes on Greg the Hammer Valentine who's representing Washington. Allow me to point out just how focused he appears to be. And his opponent from Seattle, Washington, weighing in. You can feel the electricity running through this arena. This is going to be some battle, one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano. Man, this card is just packed with so many great matches, and this one is definitely among the most anticipated, I'd say. And guys, it sounds like Sydney is just as eager for this match as we are. He's inflicting some serious pain here. Lights up his chest with a chop. That's a classic textbook maneuver. Oh, wow. He's simply reminding him that he's here. Look at Greg the Hammer Valentine here. He hits him with a nasty chop. That strike hit the spot. There's no way he could have avoided that blow. Nice move. He's taking some offense. We all know, though, this guy has plenty of fight left in him. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Cole. This Break the hammer, Valentine, going for the cover. He's got plenty of gas left in the tank. That would have been a shocker. He wants to do this in the ring. That was like seeing someone getting hurled. A simply devastating elbow drop. Got the reversal. And what a reversal from Greg the Hammer Valentine. Neutralizes him with an elbow. Looks like he's starting to tire. I'd say he's starting to feel the pressure a bit. I'd never count this guy out, but I'll tell you what, he's not looking. Shoulders down, is it enough? Didn't have to dig very deep to kick out of that one. And the match continues. He's in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, it's gonna get a lot tougher. Greg Valentine starting to fade. I fully expect him to bounce back, though. This is the type of one-on-one -on -one atmosphere where he thrives. I wouldn't call for the medics just yet, Cole. He still appears to be in pretty good shape here. He's not going to like this. Better stay right where he is. Just look at this man. He's all business. An impressive strike there. Great the hammer, Valentine is making his presence known. Three. Four. 
Seems like these guys are letting out a lot of pent-up frustration tonight. Six. Near a count out here, Corey. It would be a shame if this ends in a count out, Cole. He has him right where he wants him. Oh boy, he is rolling. Uh oh, epic from behind. Boom! We've seen this before. The second step, only the prelude to the final. The triple letter. Ooh, he's back in control here. Greg Valentine is in trouble. Here we go for the win. He's taking a long time to get up, guys. Perhaps playing a little possum here, Cole. Flips the script on him there. He is a one-man gang in there. It's got to be over now. That has got to be it. Greg Valentine is rolling now. No, he reverses it. He's in trouble. Both arms hooked by Epico. Wow. See you. Bye. To think, I almost wrote him off earlier. Looking at it here. This one's getting ugly. You might want to turn away if you have a weak heart. He's calling for it. You better stay right where he is. The guy can only absorb so much of that. He misses there. You just can't miss by that much, Cole. I think it's clear that Greg the Hammer Valentine is feeling the physicality of this match. He might just have nothing left to give, guys. Oh, man, he has plenty of reason to be concerned here, guys. But you know what? So does his opposition. This is about as close as it gets. Four. Five. Looks to me Six. like these superstars are running on fumes right about now. Back now inside the ring. Look at the hammer stalking him. Given their performances tonight, it's too bad one of these superstars has to walk out of here on the losing end. Break the hammer, Valentine gets the win. Despite a spirited display by Puerto Rico's Epico Cologne, it was Washington State's representative Greg the Hammer Valentine who progressed to the second round where he'll be taking on the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels. That's it for this video. Hope you've enjoyed. Like and subscribe. Next time out, it's two men from the main roster as the New Day's Xavier Woods takes on Braun Strowman in another first round matchup.